Um, did you guys used to play FSU every year when you were? We played FSU every year, so it uh, feels very, very similar, yeah. uh, just like the old days. Well, what are your feelings about FSU? I'm not a big FSU fan. I'll be <laughs> honest with you. You know, like uh, I love the Gators, and yeah. uh, you know, Gators and Seminoles don't get along yeah. very good. And uh, they beat us uh, in 11 years. They, they, they beat us once. Really? So uh, we were pretty proud of that record, and hopefully we can have the same result uh, on Friday. You, you know you were what and one against them? I don't know. I know we lost one. I don't remember too many of the times uh, that we won, but I remember the one time we lost. Did you play them once every year? How many times? We played them once every year, and a lot of times we'd play them in the NCAA because okay. you'd, you'd have that you're like that for the area. regional. Yeah, yeah. exactly. So when was it they beat you? What uh, they beat us in 2008. At okay. Florida State at the beginning of the year, 4-3. Okay. And then at the end of the year, we beat them at Florida State and the NCAA to revenge it. So, uh, um, you know, they obviously, I'm, I'm joking, Florida State's got a really good program. Yeah. I, we know them very well. But, uh, yeah, I, I definitely don't like losing to Florida State. Yeah. So you're probably 12 and 1. Or, I'll look no, it's up. a little bit more than that. I would oh, really? say I, okay. I can find it for you if you want. Okay. I'll, I'll, I'll check with Okay. I'll, I'll, I'll put somebody on. <laughs> okay. Well, what did you think when you saw the Florida State pop up next year? Um, well, I mean, then I think that Florida State uh, this year is one of their, their best teams. They got two very good players at the top of the lineup. They got good doubles, and uh, they've had a good year. So, uh, you know, it's a tough draw, Florida State yeah. in the first round. But I'm sure they're looking at it, and they're not too happy with uh, having to play the Razorbacks first yeah. round either. When you saw him, you're thinking like, yeah, okay, you know, like, hey, uh, no, I wasn't. No, I don't. I don't. I don't ever do that. No, no, I don't. No, mean like you're no. gonna roll over. Right yeah, you're thinking, oh, okay, an old adversary. Yeah, like you're. It's you know. more like playing an SEC team where you're yeah. comfortable. You kind of know yeah. what the uh, coaching philosophy is, how they're gonna play the doubles, uh, yeah. how the coaches behave, and what they think about, you know, how to do things. So, yeah, I do like it that way. Yeah. It's not gonna be an unknown. Yeah. It's been a long time since Arnson went back to back years. How, how do you feel about that? You know, not being yeah, well, wonder, I, wonders or yeah, whatever. Yeah, I'm, you know? I'm, I'm, uh, we're pleased to have gone two years in a row. And, you know, we were um, above 500 uh, in the SEC for two years in a row and top half of the league for two years in a row. So that's a good start. Um, you know, I'm of the school where uh, I think that I got the opportunity to be here the minimum bars to get in the NCAA right. and we want to build a program where we can compete in the, in the NCAA for championships and we're not that far away this year if we you never know if we get on a run we could uh, hurt some people how many of your singles guys I should know this but I don't how many yeah. of your singles guys played in the NCAA last year? Uh, Michael played in the NCAA last year and uh, Jose was an alternate so this year we've got two guys in and uh, Mike seated in singles, and then uh, Mike and Jose are seated in the double. So it's definitely a better individual year for us this year. It hasn't been as good a team year so far, yeah. but we're hoping to turn that around at the NCAA. Yeah. And how many of your doubles guys played last year? Uh, Mike and his partner Michelani did. Okay. So we got one more individual yeah. entry. So you got three guys. Yeah. So out of that, I mean, how, how much does that help, do you think? Well, I think it helps a lot because. Uh, you know, Jose and Mike have been two of the best players in, in the nation. And so anytime that you're, the other teams are looking at us, there's a little bit of fear because they know, well, we can get to two uh, against anybody. We can beat anybody at one and two. And so then you only have to get two more points to win the team match. So that, that definitely scares the other team, and it makes our team feel a little bit more confident. Um, how do you feel like you guys are playing going into the regional? I felt like that the best uh, two weekends of the year for us have, w was the last weekend of the regular season in the SEC tournament. We played a good match against Georgia in the SEC tournament, and it was going to be 4-3 if they'd have finished the matches, and it was close. And then we beat Kentucky and Vanderbilt the weekend before that. So I think we're playing better, and I'm, I'm optimistic uh, about uh, the first round match against Florida State and the rest of the tournament if we can advance. All these years you coach in the SEC, um, how do you think it, playing in the SEC prepares you know, yeah. your team or any team for the NCAA? Well, I, I think in almost every sport it's a huge advantage to be in the SEC not only from resources but competition you get tough if you're not tough you're gonna get eaten alive in the SEC in every sport then by the time you get to the national tournament you're used to the doggy dog world of uh, you know that level of competition so that definitely helps you and it's a big advantage for Arkansas like it is for all the other SEC teams